Percy the Great was feeling odd. He had not been able to build up his team and was sitting in a jet field. Just then, Thomas came bustling into the air. Good morning, Percy. How are you feeling? <coughs> Thomas sat patiently for a response, but got one. Percy struggled to give one. Finally, Percy was able to respond. I feel dreadful, Thomas. I don't know if it's been a bad one of coal or salty water. Never since yesterday, couldn't get his steam. Thomas felt sorry for Percy. Sure, Percy, said Thomas. At least he'll get a break from your normally busy days. The Double Hat tried everything to get Percy steam, but nothing worked. Not even a group of trained professionals from a different franchise could help. It's not fair, said James. What's not fair, said Thomas. Kind of flat control is making us do Percy's job as well as our own. But Percy's a villain, said Thomas. Ha! <laughs> Lies, snorted James. He probably just wanted a day off. Bless, it's the busy summer season. And that little bugger is making us get worked all of our way. I deserve a rest. I be quiet, said Thomas. I didn't like it the other things. Before James could reply, God knows what he Suck up, spawned James, as he puffed out of the stage. Meanwhile, Percy was still sitting in the yard. He finally started to get feeling better, he was making steam. Just then, a shady character walked into the yard looking at him. Wait a second! What do you think you're doing? Stop! Stop! Well, Percy, left the yard. Stop! Stop! Rush through Ellsworth. Mm -hmm. Stupid train obsessed. Oh my goodness, get out of the way! I'm, I'm sorry, guys, it's the end of the day again. Ah! <laughs> I killed a person. And we were not. It's, I'll be scrapped. <laughs>